Welcome to Heath Rouse Barbecue. Today we're going to be cooking up a sweet and spicy bacon cheese dip on the Traeger 885. Let's get started. The first thing we want to do to get started is we take two blocks of cream cheese, set them out at room temperature for about an hour and let them soften up. Then we want to add two cups of good melting cheddar cheese, okay? Not none of the cheap stuff with all the oil and stuff on it. It's better to shred it yourself. Now we've got about two to three green onions chopped up. We want to add in there, clean that out. Now I'm going to take some beef rub for seasoning. You can use anything you like, salt and pepper. This just just got some good heat to it and some good color, so that's what I'm gonna use. Now I'm gonna get this mixed up and I'm gonna get it in my skillet that I'm gonna grease up. And once I do that, I'm gonna come back and top it with bacon and eight Ritz crackers that's been chopped up, or not chopped up, kinda mashed up. And so I'm gonna get it on my Traeger at 350 degrees and let it go for about 30 to 35 minutes and let it get bubbly. And then we're gonna melt some of this peach pepper jelly and ease over the top of it and it's going to make a great great game day dip for your next party let's get this mixed up all right we're back we've got our cheeses mixed up with our green onions and we've got it molded into our pan now i will tell you it's a little easier if you put on some gloves and kind of mold it like a cheese ball and mash it in so once we do that i'm going to take and i'm going to hit it with a little more beef rub just across the top there, all right? I want that good pepper pop from this. Now I'm gonna take the eight slices of bacon that we cooked in the oven and diced up. I'm gonna throw them in here now, the eight Ritz crackers that we busted up in this Ziploc bag, I'm gonna add to this. Now the little bit of fat from the bacon as it renders will help the crackers. And what you wanna do, you wanna make a crumbly top on all this once you get it mixed up. You can see how it does the bacon here, how all the crackers stick to it. And so now we just want to take and spread it around. Now once we get it all spread out, like I say, we're going to get it over here on our Traeger that's already running at 350 degrees and let it get good and bubbly and warm and that little bit of cracker crust crisp up. We're gonna melt our peach pepper jelly and we're gonna kinda of ooze over the top. We're gonna to be ready to taste this dip. Let's get it on the grill over here. All right, we're back. Our sweet and spicy bacon cheese dip of, is off of our Traeger 885. Remember, we cooked with hickory pellets, 350 degrees. We took two blocks of cream cheese, some green onions, some cheddar cheese, and some of my beef rub here. We mixed up in the bottom of this cast iron dish and we topped it with some fresh chopped bacon and some rich crackers we crushed up. And the only thing left to do is take some of this spicy peach pepper jelly and drizzle over the top. Now, if you don't have peach pepper jelly. You can use any kind of pepper jelly you like. Now the only thing we recommend is you warm it up in the microwave a little bit where it's pourable like this and you just get it on, put it ever however you want. Now you can take whatever chips or crackers you want and dip away. There's only one thing left to do and that's get in here and try this dip. It's hot. I know it might burn my mouth, but oh well. Mm. That was so good I had to go back for another bite. Mm. That is really good. I'm going to enjoy it this weekend watching the game on TV. If you like what we're doing, be sure to like, subscribe, follow along, share it with your friends. You can find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and YouTube. We'll see you next week with a new recipe.